Let's not forget the title is on the line here tonight. How can I forget? I've been looking forward to this match for a long time. His skills, his talent, that's what helped him to earn this opportunity. And that's what will win him the title tonight. Make way for the double champ. Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. You talk about standing at the top of the mountain, this guy is at the peak of Mount Everest. Indeed, it is going to take a monumental effort to take either one of this guy's titles. With this championship title in play, you can expect this match to be something special. Big title match here. In my opinion, this championship could main event any show, any place, any time. Bold declaration, Byron, but given the competitors vying for the title tonight, I'd be inclined to agree. Goodness gracious. No respect being shown whatsoever with those stomps. to stomp in every single part of his body. His body lock applied. Great body control. Uh-oh, submission move. Fujiwara on bar. Oh, bot trying to find a way out. And he's out and delivers a knee. Kick out. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. 
Up and down. What a gourd buster. And he's taking this to the outside now. Boom. Bicycle knee strike. Oh, oh, on the jaw. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. Jarring impact. Whip back into the ring. No way. Oh, no. Crashing hard onto the floor. Wildly throwing your body out of the ring like that is more often than not going to provide such a result. That was an example of boldness backfiring. And we can't overlook how devastating that DDT was. Out of the way in time. Ooh, harsh kick. Oh, that can shatter a jump. Shark punch. Up across the shoulders. Right into a spine buster. Three. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Get back here, leg lariat. And just like that, we've kicked the tempo up a notch. Sure was pretty, but we don't judge matches on style points. And a roundhouse. Headed up, he's thinking back. Record. Covered by the champ. What? Oh, he kicked out. You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. Got the single arm under him. Suplex. And up the turnbuckles we go. Perched up top. I mean, knee drop. Covered by the challenger. The champ just beats the three count. This could be a tipping point in this match. He had it scouted. Here it comes. Special delivery. Attitude adjustment. Is it enough? Two count. And the champ does not end it. And frustration might be starting to set in. That extra rotation creates so much more force than a standard splash. Big form. Brought down and just uh, twisting the... Oh, twisting the neck. Off the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Look at the high frog splash. And into the count. There's two! Kicks out at two and a half. Oh, man, my heart skipped a beat. Ooh, what a damaging blow. Oh, round and round we go. Tilt the world head scissors. This is an incessant attack being brought to him. He can't just think of riding this out. He has to get on offense. Whoa! Suicide dive to the outside. Cole does it better. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. Back elbow blows that one up. Can't quite get him there. Like he's got 11 arms and feet. Oh, able to counter. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Rapid fire. Ah, oh, forearm! What a combo! Bang! And he's just picking him apart now. This is what he feeds off of. Has them hooked. Rolling cutter. Good 
Great defense. Stump puller leg snap. Very effective. Oh, no. Trapping the arm. A vicious stomps to the hand. Oh, hold on. Is he thinking of a submission here? Wow, the power that takes is insane. Tap out. Do it now. Live to fight another day. Time to hit the panic button. Oh, and he's able to find enough grip to fight out of the hole. Crucial escape here. Hits him with the counter. Cover for the championship. Yeah, no. He doesn't get the three. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Fist directly to the gut. Inverted atomic drop. Oh, what a kick. Ooh, that was nasty. You can begin to see it in these superstars' faces. Exhaustion is beginning to set in. They're starting to breathe heavier. This is the time where matches are won and lost. Champions need to finish the job. Shoulders down. A kick out. I don't believe it. How did the challengers survive that? By the skin of their teeth. And don't expect the champ to start going easy on them now. Big move, but it's still unable to end this. Uh-oh. Suicide dive. Whatever it takes to win. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. A, a kick to the face. How humiliating. Listen to this place. And a kick to the back. Kicks to the face. Oh, man. Good grief. Turn your lights out. Textbook side rush and leg sweep. Uh, just raining down punches. Oh, my gosh. Uh-oh. Elbow drop. Boom! He's entered a state of distress now. This is where his fortitude will be put to the test. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. Gets inside the ring. The sleeper is cinched in, and you can see little by little the opponent is fading. The official asking him, is he going to tap? Is he going to tap out? In trouble here? Oh, oh, what a great counter. That'll break it up. Oh, look at the knee strikes. Just endless knee strikes. Gets him out of that spot. Falcon arrow. No, he's right. The champ will stay champ. Pin. That's it. The champ stays the champ. certainly proved himself a superstar to watch with this one. That's what happens when you put in the preparation and the training.